Thank you, Mayor. This will take us to tab five, our Centros Park monthly update from the county manager. Thank you, Mr. Chairman and fellow board. It's getting really exciting because I think the presentation you will see tonight that a lot of activity and a lot of finished work is moving to the inside and has been demobilization of cranes. So it's getting exciting because the time is drawing near. Let's go ahead with the first slide. Uh, construction uh, update. We've spent $365,505,089 uh, completed to date with 75.1% of the this, this site completed. 1,100 workers currently work on the ball site, 265 workers on the mixed-use site, over 2.489 million man-hours through uh, July, and no lost time injuries to date, which is remarkable on this particular site. We're going to give some area views. This is an area view looking from the east park into the west. You also see the uh, Comcast building, which I will mention later. Uh, this coming, but that is an area of view there. Um, more and more man hours, as I stated, it's uh, they're moving indoors with the interior finishes underway. And the lower concrete seating bowl is complete. Installation of stadium seating continues. Installation of the vertical circulation ramps, elevators, and escalators are ongoing. Uh, this is a view of uh, the right field corner from inside the seating bowl, and it's a panoramic view from the bowl from the right field. And this photo was taken August the 17th of this year. This is a view of home plate, again from the inside of the bowl, looking around home plate, and the installation of lower bowl concrete complete, and the cranes, as I mentioned, have been demobilized. There are no cranes on the inside of the, the stadium at this time. This is a view of left field corner, up to the third baseline to left field, and this photo was taken the 17th as well of August. Home plate sunscreen nearly complete. Uh, here as we look at that from the bowl. Uh, the home uh, plate seating bowl is complete and with a power and data installed. And this section is to be equipped with enhanced data, Wi-Fi video components uh, on that as well. LED lighting is being installed on the canopy. Uh, that was taken August the 15th. Uh, so there's a lot there. This is the Delta Club. Uh, so you see cabinetry is being installed, and it gives you a feel that they are really moving to the inside with some of the interior finishes. This next is a bird eye view of home plate, the area of roofing of home plate, sunscreen almost complete at present. We mentioned that earlier. But this gives you a bird eye view of, of that as well. The next slide show that the escalators are under construction and underway with that completion as well. Um, it's moving on. And they got handrails um, uh, on the third base ramp. Handrails is what I'm showing there. They are underway on the ramps. This is an important part of the computer, uh, of the facility, the walk-in bill coolers. Uh, uh, to cheer your beverage of choice. Uh, so that's there on the way. Uh, this is the affinity and the chop sign below the iconic A. So that's it in there with that as well. This shows a, a, the next slide, uh, the chop house taking shape. This two-story facility is more than twice the size of the original and featured outdoor uh, space with great views of the field. This one shows some of the glass windows are being installed on the Comcast building. So you can see that it's really taking shape and, and move along as well, which is right adjacent to it. Uh, steel in being erected or complete uh, for the Roxy Theater, uh, and uh, that steel structure is in place. So now they can start doing that. Uh, some of the hardscapes and looking at sidewalks and the mobility around, but they are, that work has begun on some of the hardscape around the exterior of the stadium as well. The next one shows the plaza entrance uh, there on that one, which is 
We got a total work to date as of June 27, 2016, $405,810,895 on the ballpark. I worked to Cobb County Companies, $263 million or 64.8%, and worked to DBE Companies, $75 million or 18.5%. And as continue, we continue to work with security staff and our police in informing that and getting ready for the game day uh, first pitch. So that will be a continuing effort to work with the Brave Security and a private company to make sure that we are ready for that. So to ensure that our visitors are safe when they visit the ballpark. With that, Mr. Chairman, that is a quick update. And uh, um, a lot of our future presentation will feature a lot on the interior of the building. Perfect. Thank you. Any questions or comments for the time manager? Thank you, sir. Thank you. This takes us to tab six, our first public comment. Councilor. First speaker is Chris Smith, if you'd come forward. Good evening. It's not realistic to expect Cobb County to grow. Excuse me, ma'am. I'm 